Today is my last first day of school ever. Good morning everyone and welcome back to the vlog. It is bright and early, it's about 7.20 right now, and today is my last first day of school ever. So today is the first day of classes of my last semester of college, and that is so crazy to think that I'm never going to have a first day of school anymore. So I start my day off with an 8 a.m. in-person class all the way across campus. It's probably like a 20 to 30 minute walk. And just my luck, we had a massive winter storm yesterday. It's been snowing for almost 24 hours and I get to walk to class in it. So I'm gonna bundle up in my like heavy duty winter boots and I'm wearing like the warmest, like big Sherpa I could find and jeans, which I normally don't like to wear but those are warmer than leggings and I'm just gonna like hardcore bundle up and put on a podcast and walk across campus, finish my class, and I will check in with you guys after, let you know how it goes. Okay you guys, I made it back from class it was a journey so the snow was so deep i'm so glad i wore my heavy duty boots i'll insert a picture here if i can but basically at some parts the snow went like halfway up my leg past my boots it was like 7 30 a.m so probably about half of the sidewalks were shoveled but the rest weren't so i was walking in like deep snow and you know I hadn't shoveled yet, so I'm not blaming them, but anyway, I was in this new building I had never been in before. No one in my class had been in that building because the professor asked us. We're all seniors. We've been in tons of buildings on campus, but this is a business class, and for some reason, they decided that the business class was going to be in the education building. So this building is all the way across campus and none of us knew where it was so we were all just like roaming around the building we all made it but the people behind me in class were like they were talking and they were annoyed because they're like we pay to use the business building and our class isn't in the business building why are we here which i can relate to i live five minutes from the business building and 25 minutes from this building but it's fine I just popped in a podcast and walked all the way there. By the time I got there, I was actually like sweating because a 25 minute walk is pretty far. So I got home and I just dumped my backpack inside and I shoveled because, you know, we gotta be nice. We gotta shovel the sidewalks so people can walk. So it's a lot better outside now. Let me show you. So the streets are pretty much plowed and most of the sidewalks are shoveled. So. It's still snowy, but it doesn't look as bad. So I was all wet from the snow and sweaty from shoveling when I got back from class. So I changed my clothes. I made myself look presentable again. Um, I mean, I'm not wearing anything fancy. I'm wearing a zip up jacket and some sweatpants because I'm not leaving the house anymore and I might as well be warm and comfy. So I have a class over Zoom next actually. So I had about an hour and a half break um, in between my first class and this class. So I have a Zoom class, which is kind of new for me actually because, and this is this was really rare, but I had over half of my classes in person last semester and then the rest were kind of do on your own pre-recorded lectures. So having to go on Zoom at a specific time for class is going to be a new thing for me this semester so i'm curious to see how that will be like how how i can pay attention over zoom like how well that works out so we'll see so i have that class and then right after that class i have an online yoga class and i'm excited for that because 
I didn't work out this morning because there was a snowstorm. So it's nice that I can like get some exercise and meditation and yoga in when I don't have time to exercise in the morning and when there's a snowstorm. So that should be fun. And then after that, I have a lunch break for an hour and a half. And then I have one more Zoom class. So I will check in with you guys at my lunch break and let you know how all of that went. All right, it got so bright outside, so I look super, super pale, but I finished the class. It was not bad at all. Um, we actually have a professor that, like this is her first class she's ever teaching, so she's super excited and I don't know, she seems very organized and like approachable, so I feel like I'll really like her. And today, all we did is go over the syllabus and like the course content. We did not get into like any actual class stuff. So I guess that was kind of nice. So now is my yoga class. <sighs> okay, I just dug out all of my yoga stuff that I'm gonna need for class. So I have this big purple mat it's super thick, which I like because like a lot of mats are normally super thin. Ooh, I'm out of breath. I got this one from Amazon, so I can link it down below if they still have it. Okay, and then we're also supposed to have two blocks. So I just have two of this like seafoam color. And then I have a purple strap that came unwinded, so. And now I'm gonna set up for my yoga class. Okay, so my room is super small, so this mat barely fits, but this is my setup. I have, you know, the Zoom ready on that chair, and then the yoga mat, and my blocks, and I do what I can do with a small room. So, I just finished my online yoga class, and it went the full hour and 15 minutes, but we didn't do any yoga. First of all, we did where each person in the class introduces themselves, and there's 50 people in the class. So that took a good 30 minutes, and then we spent the next 45 minutes going over the syllabus. I did not need to sit on the floor on my mat the whole time. I could have sat at my desk, that would have been way more comfortable, but I got through it. It was really boring going through a syllabus instead of doing yoga. It's now two o'clock and I'm very, very hungry. So I'm gonna eat some lunch. And then I have one more class and then I'm done. So it has been a while since I hopped on here, but I finished all my classes for the day. I threw on my blue light glasses for my last class today because I think I was getting a headache from staring at my computer so much. But I went to my last class. We went over some content, but it wasn't too much. I'm sorry if you can hear like Casper chewing on his tree. It's kind of loud. But yes, I finished my last class and then I had a meeting for one of my student orgs and now my day is done. I just need to make some dinner and then I think I'm going to relax for the rest of the night. I have a lot of tomorrow free to work on homework because I definitely have a lot but it has been a very long day. So me and Dom are gonna make some dinner right now. Um, we're making these bruschetta zucchini boats with couscous and last time I had couscous, it was so good. So I'm really excited to try this. We actually switched our HelloFresh meal plan to the low calorie or calorie smart, I think it's called. And I don't know, they've been really good so far and I'm excited to try it. We were getting a lot of repeats with the meat and veggies plan and I'm trying to eat better and these meals just sounded really good so we thought we would try them. All right, we made dinner. It was so delicious. Sorry, I just stuck my finger in front of the camera. <laughs> Let me adjust. All right, dinner was so good. Um, I was so hungry by the time it was finished that I forgot to film it but very good. Highly recommend. So it has been a very long day. My 
what is it called my last first day of school is officially over i'm exhausted and tomorrow is gonna be a pretty busy day basically i only have classes on tuesdays and thursdays but all of my tuesday classes assigned homework for thursday and tomorrow's wednesday so i am going to be working on a ton of homework tomorrow so I'm gonna try to get up relatively early and get a good start on the morning. So I'm just gonna chill the rest of the night. So I'm gonna say good night. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one.